It's been two years since a tragic event occurred in one of our Tallahassee neighborhoods. I'm Terry Gilliam, your neighborhood reporter. New developments are happening with this case, and I find out what it is and how the victim's family is feeling. I'm okay. S still, uh, still grieving. Gina Richardson is Malik Richardson's mom. I sat with Gina, Malik's father Charles, and grandmother, Deandra Richardson. They tell me how they remember Malik. My only son, and uh, he was a beautiful, beautiful young man, um, good spirit. He, he was the life of the party. Malik Richardson was a former Marine. His life was cut short at just 24 years old in July 2022. He was visiting his girlfriend at the time on Tallahassee's northwest side. Two years, two months, 11 days, exactly 804 days to this day. That person took our son from us. The problem is that person is still unknown. Now Tallahassee police will hand the case to the Big Ben Cold Case Task Force. That task force says their mission is to put Malik's story in the spotlight and ask the community for help in finding justice. That we need justice. We, we deserve that. My son deserves that. Big Ben Cold Case Task Force Detective Mark Ray says this case will come down to small details. The, the smallest little detail can help. It could be that you were leaving uh, some old granny that night and you saw a car speeding out and you just thought it was someone leaving a, a party late and it was trying to get home. Um, you might have saw or heard something. You might have heard an argument. Um, just those little details that maybe hadn't come forward to begin with we can use now because we have a, a bigger picture of the case. If you have information about this cold case, you're asked to call 850-410-7611. You can also remain anonymous by calling Crime Solvers at 850-574-TIPS. I've also included those phone numbers with this story at WTXL.TV. The Richardson family tells me they're still waiting on one thing, justice. We just want justice from the legal. You said that over and over. Yeah. That's our, our main objective is finding the person and hold, them and hold him accountable. The family also tells me that they plan to continue to let their voices be heard until they get justice for their loved one. In Tallahassee, Terry Gilliam, ABC 27.